Hi all, and welcome to the video. In this one, it's Fruit V Paid, number two. You know, for a minute there, I thought that was a fly squashed on my monitor, but actually, no, it's a little starship going up to the battle station. Yes, here we are. How have we progressed? Well, I did what I said I was going to do, and I've made one of these perfected alien tank armor. Very cheap to make, really. If you shop on GMI, all the parts are pretty cheap. As you can see, we've hit level 74. I just went killing hecklers just for the just for the lols and uh, yeah we kind of just powered through them absolutely powered and implants and such wise well we have been a little busy you can see I've thrown in some old um, and a few new uh, sims some of them are quite expensive ones on GMI but I only use them for a few levels and then put them back on and resell them I've grabbed touch of the gripper which is pretty nice gives you strength and brawl and a bit of health plus the add damage we've gone for infantry mostly i like these yes you can get a singular skill higher than this but you can't get all of those skills you see there you're getting first aid matter creation matter met biomet psycho mod you're getting all those skills instead of like a regular head implant, which I don't think I've got in here anymore. Um, which would only give you one shining skill. Oh, there you go. So there, yeah, 55 is higher than 46. But in terms of IP, you look how much you got there. What was that one? Yeah, that's for later. <laughs> I can't do that one yet. Uh, and so on. So we got that, got the ear. Again, you get lots of extras. Uh, I Same again, really, as the head. Chest. Throwing that one in there. Uh, left arm, because you get the add def, brawl, strength. A bunch of skills that aren't really helping. But you also get the nano skill. Uh, waste, once again. That's a bit of a lobby one. But it, it's down to which ones drop. The next waste that drops, I think, is an 88 or something. But nice to have evades, ACs, and nano skills as well as base stats. Pretty nice. Uh, thigh, same again, as you can see there. I've got a foot lined up, but it's uh, too high for me to use yet. Same thing again, evades, and stam, and agility, and max health, etc., and body dev. So once you start stacking all those up, I think that's the only one I kind of regret, <laughs> because you lose the uh, MA skill a little bit, but not much. And one of the wrists is kind of useful as well. Um, so yeah, that's where we're at at the moment. Uh, Armour-wise, I'm still using the same stuff. You can see there, just the newcomers, and, uh, and the headpiece, which is leveling up. Same token board, uh, same rings, etc. Picked up the MEMS and uh, the five slot, which wasn't difficult. Didn't get a, uh, a tank armor off got. I did kill him a few times, but hey. So, um, yeah, like I say, being able to run off to Shadowlands and pound on hecklers for a little bit is uh, quite nice. And we've got a bunch of dailies lined up. So, oh yeah, and of course, the other thing that's happening with paid over through, of course, is research so i've completed all the level ones i'm back on to level twos now so i'm going to gain nano skill there then i'll do the two there actually accidentally did reflex three but i wanted the extra martial arts and that i just did 100 percent uh research on the slider remind myself yes i did set it back and then perks wise uh maxed out champion of light infantry Enhanced DNA, I might swap that one out shortly. Acrobat, we've now got two levels of that. A little bit in Brawler, which is nice. Careful in Battle, I've now got number two. A bit more Add Def, which is also nice. And we are at Alien level seven already. I know people that have hit 200, and they're still AI level something silly. So we've now got Procs running as well. I'm going to go and do the Alien Daily first. We've hit... I think at 7 is about the point where killing actual aliens in the mission 
doesn't reward you enough to warrant doing it over time. <laughs> that makes sense. Just going for the actual mission reward is better. Oh, light beams, god rays. And fail at jumping off. There we go. Yes, indeed. I like god rays even when they're subtle. Yes, I do. Yeah, they are. They're pretty cool. They're pretty cool. But yeah, he's hitting like a bit of a tank now. Bit of a bit of a train thing. Plenty of HP. I've got extra buffage. As you can see there, BMOS. The rest are pretty much self-buffed, apart from the obvious hack and quack and grid space freedom. Hey there. And of course we've now got Crave. Which hits pretty hard as well. There you go, 500. At this level, oh, that's pretty nice. Now the regular daily we've got is a bit of a weird one, to be honest. It's the uh, the jewellery one. So I need five little bits of jewellery. It gives you a uh, Jensen gem cutter. So hopefully the ones we pick up will be fine. Yeah, I mean, you could kill everything in here if you had the time, and but for the, you know, because I'm recording and thinking in those terms, I probably wouldn't. Yesterday I was doing that. Uh, everything <laughs> was just like, yeah, take your time. So I spent pretty much a few hours on Sunday just grinding and doing, you know, which is always fun. Yeah, these, these mobs are definitely a little tougher. I mean, they're not a problem, but they are definitely taking a little longer to kill. The last time I did this mission, uh, he was killing mobs in about one or two hits, but I think primarily that was down to he rolled the mission at level 56 and then actually did the mission at level, like, 66 by the time I got out of the temple, messing around in there, killing Len. <laughs> so... Yeah, and the reason, of course, he's, he's gaining as much XP as he is, is he's paid, so therefore uh, he's got access to stuff like this, Nanocam. I think you can get those, but I mean, they're on GMI, you can buy them. Um, they were probably duped, because I don't think Funcom... Oh, yeah, props. I don't think Funcom uh, sold that many of them, not the price they are. And the, there's people on there selling them for about a thousand, so... You know, they've got 4,000 of them. There's no way someone bought 4,000. This little bit of corridor. You're so close to doors, the door hitbox gets in the bloody way. Yeah, it's not struggling with you. So yeah, they, they at some point probably were duped. New ones and no drops, so I don't know. But they're there, and you know, Funcom's attitude is, oh, well, if you get one, you get one. They're not going to do anything, so hey. Yeah, if I was not recording, I would probably kill everything inside this mission. Every mob. Just because. Oh, and I got this. <laughs> Gnuff's Eternal Rift Crystal. You get random, like, shrine buffs from it. You got this time. Oh, wait, I got, like, a nano. <laughs> that I don't need. Sometimes you get an XP boost, a damage buff, buff, etc. But it is random and you can only click it every 20 minutes. You can see the cool cooldowns on it there. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool. That XP thing's still running. It is. Um, and I had that problem on the last one, which has continued, which is the chain um, dailies. The ones where you have to, you know, three of this, four of that, 20 of the other. Um, we're not triggering the freelancers one, you know, problem, kind of a deal, yes indeed. So we were, we were stuck with that. So I still haven't cleared that one yet. Did manage to get all the way down to Tara, took two attempts, I will be honest about that, I did have to try twice. I got, it was getting nuked that was the thing, I got nuked by a, um, one of the cave lizard uh, mobs in there on the second run through lucky <laughs> hey lucky how's it going if you do watch this video yeah lucky hit me with rrfe <laughs> as i was running past i was like cheers dude it, it kind of like would have known oh my god you know like level sub 100 in 
in Tara, what are they doing? Well, they're going to do the, the Tara Daily, which you get the full XP reward for. If you can get down and target Tara, I wouldn't suggest trying while there's uh, actual PvP going on in there. Um, well, you could, but at lower levels you're generally ignored, you know, so to speak, because nobody can attack you anyway, so... You're kind of like, what the bloody hell are you doing here? Occasionally you will get a Loby in there who's there just because you get Lobies doing the whole running down thing. Just to, and You literally only have to tab on Tara to get the mission reward. I have a ball of light that's not really helping me. Oh, go on, I'll kill you while we're in here. Don't need to. The mission is complete. There's loads more on this every time. If you go all the way up kind of to the north east corner there is a uh, big big old room in fact there's like a mini boss in there it's not a general but he can drop things i've never done that if you've only ever gone this far in the mission i'll try and get to it should be able to usually off in this corner i think or near, it could be near the middle i might have that wrong Yep, there you go. Here's the guy. Cries all guardian. So he, he looks a bit like a general, plus you've got all the alien cocoons you could ever need in here. Kind of nice. Let's give him some of that. I haven't hotkeyed that perk yet. So. He's got the extended whatever the hell they are. There you go. So he'll, he'll drop a weapon or something. Yeah, not... Shotgun, not really our thing. <laughs> right, so we've got a bit of a run to make for the second part. Definitely, but let's... Uh, we'll just take the quick route out. So yeah, you could stay in there and do the rest of the uh, the mobs in there. That's quite a lot of uh, alien XP. But uh, I think we hit a cap if we hand this one in. I'm not sure. Oop, where are we? Yeah. Uh, I would have to look up exactly what level you have to be to get AI 8. So, I don't think we'll get enough um, alien XP reward to actually fill that bar. Let's have a look. Mission complete. Yeah, not quite. If I'd have stayed in there, killed, you know, 10 mobs or so, or even more than that, that, that would have done that. We would have, uh, we would have gotten through but it would have like wasted the alien XP because it would have just said you can't go any further than this. You know, you, you need X level X to actually get that level. Right, so we want to go to Biomare. Uh, yeah, I think we're going to be going full death and doing a little bit of running through the Wampers again and praying we don't crash. Have I got... I uh, haven't got a physical yalm, actually. No, I don't. I don't have a physical yalm. I have a nano yalm, which I haven't put on there, strangely. Okay, program, space. Yeah, I have that there. For what we're doing, I I think a physical yalm is best. Because you, you, even, you know, as soon as you come out of the grid, you're your flying kind of deal, you know? Where you don't have to stop and cast it. Let's have a look. I don't know if I've got enough VP left. I spent a lot on silliness, to be honest with you. Do, do, do. Yeah, um, yeah, it only costs one. Except... There you go, unpacked it. I'm kind of semi-regretting not capping that, but I think I, from memory, to get AI 8, I think you need a level more than we are, if you know what I mean. Right, let's swap this in. Ooh, go to camera, angle for the win. All right, we're going to go grid first. Then do a bit of Wampa jumping and hoping the engine doesn't crash. <laughs> And it is, like I say, I was amazed that we got away with uh, 
recording it and getting in there last time on the Frubet May. Yes, indeed. Right, firstly, 2HO. Over the wall, and straight to Longest Road, if we don't crash. If we do, it's a bit of a palaver. Come on, hang in there, engine. Yes. Just need to, every time in a yarn, in third person, whenever I zone, it resets the camera, which is annoying. Stop doing that. Okay, in we go. Someone looking at my... Oh, I've got those guys. <laughs> Why? What are you doing, Sierra? Trying to be, trying to be funny. I think he was asking about my NT earlier. So I'll, I'll, I'll log them in, and we can, you know, go over everything. Oh, well done. Okay then. Let's try that again. Um, this time without the jumping. <laughs> I haven't done that in years. Jump through something and actually zone clean through it. Right, I think we can come off full death now. Is that not fruit? Well, duh, he's got alien levels. How can he be a fruit? Oh, God. Some people have not had their coffee this morning. No, they haven't. Oh yeah, I need to be looting these, don't I? I want gems, I want gems. Uh, silver nugget, I don't think that counts, actually. Toxic floater. You will die. Oh, look at that crit, 114. Yes. Touch of the gripper. And, you know, everything else. God. Uh, I think that counts. Can I even cut that? Don't need that cocoon thingy anymore. But you need 300... Oh, God. I'm going to have to go and get these cut. Or trade them over just to complete the mission. That is a pain in the arse. I hope you realise that. What if I, you know, what if it's super quiet at the time I'm logged in and I can't complete my daily because I can't find anyone to help me cut the jet? What, what do you want me to do? Spend that much IP in one skill just to complete a daily? Come on. Is that reasonable? I don't think that is reasonable. Okay, what's the... Come on. Nope. Kill a couple more of these, or well, one at least, just to see if we can get a gem. Uh, I suppose I could buy cut gems on the GMI, but it seems a bit weak, doesn't it? It's a bit bit weak source. I don't like that daily. And I hope these pearls count. It might not. Right, we're on to bloaters. I had no doubt about being able to defeat the first couple because you know if we can do it on a frub you with the same gear and a couple more levels are definitely going to be able to do it you know on paid with all the bonuses and all the advantages oh yeah procs duh remember your procs okay, one toxic bloater did he drop anything good no well, they've really, yeah, got a bit of a, a, a hate thing going on here, haven't they? But, you know, we're taking, like, zip in damage. Bloater. Bloater! Yeah, so with this guy, I am still running. 
with that cloak on. It's kind of cool. But of course, I'm getting all that extra defence from the um, from the perk line, from Acrobat, and from Careful in Battle. As you can see there, still at full lag. I could see what the hell I'm doing. Okay. Heavy cargo droids. And I, you see, I want to complete that so I can clear the bloody thing there. One of five. Where the hell am I? Oh, God. Yeah, don't start trying to read missions. There we go. Our client uh, collects perfectly cut Rubicar jewels. You'll connect five raw jewels. Use a Jensen gem cutter and deliver them to our client, Mr. Carlberg, in a perfectly cut shape. Yeah, five of the bloody things. Upload to map. Not even an option. I think he's actually in the mission building, so it's not too bad. Well, someone's recently killed him. Yay, cargo bot. You will die. Yeah, I have no fear of green mobs having, you know, been out. Kicking bottom. Yeah, I'm going to hotkey this. I'm going to move that to there. And uh, let's see now. Bar two, number three. Bar one, bar two. I'm going to change... Yeah, I'm going to put that on there. There we go. Okay, I'm going to ignore him completely. Don't need him. And I don't think I'm going to do the Ace Star quest on this guy. There just isn't any point. He's level 74 now. By the time I got that quest done, he wouldn't be in here for much longer. He'd be locked out. I don't think the Tim scope is really worth it on this guy when you, when you think he's got access to... Um, oh, yeah. Check for jewels. Check for jewels. Nothing. There's probably a better place to get the jewels from, but I just remember seeing them dropping here. The blood plasma one isn't so bad. Um, simply because you can you can kill leads anywhere and do that. So you know, straight into a backyard is fine. It does want you to go off to the whatever. Oh, hi there. Uh, that's a thing for a quest, I think. But, uh, oh god, camera. Okay, avert your eyes while the camera does something weird. There you go. You can kind of see that they they run over, realise they can't target you. I'm reset. Oh god. Yeah. Don't forget, hit number five when you're done. Hey there. What I was hoping is get this done pretty quick and head to Elysium. I've already done spec one, which is kind of nice. Show you there. That that happening. I, the first group of mobs that I killed, um, yeah, they had I, a book each, one through four. I couldn't believe it. It was like that is the fastest I have ever done that, and yet. There's jokers on GMI asking 30 million. Do not pay 30 million for the uh, assembled book. That is an absolute rip-off. They are not worth that. that. It literally took me less than six minutes, and that includes running to where the uh, redeemed mobs were at, and back again, and handing it in. EA level 75. Right, IP. Let's get into these. Can't quite get that um, back P the uh, alien armor on yet, so yes, that's why it's in social. Keeping spending pretty tight. Melly in it. Oh, has he debuffed me? Oh, right, okay. Um, nano and casting. It was m yeah, a little bit more in there and. A lot more in there. I think. Oh, no, I think it might have been sent him actually. Yeah, there's for the next nano I've got my eye on. Uh, what the hell was it? There was that one. 
first strike way off on that that I bought twice by mistake yeah this oh, well sent him oh well next level next level chief base defender my kung fu is stronger than yours where's my is that only a very short buff then I found a buff wasn't that one uh, in while I was doing the whole thing and it said you need spec one did I not upload that I may be confusing myself here. oh oh XP's run out we'll have that back thanks I may have done it I may have done that I wanted this one as well for a strength buff so you know I don't know if that stacks with any of the others don't know. I think it probably it won't stack with like prodigious strength. I don't think it'll stack with that, but uh, probably with a bunch of other stuff. Okay, let's see how we do as the mobs start getting a bit tougher. I'm feeling fairly confident. I'm going to be honest with you. I am feeling pretty confident. Right, okay. I mean, we've come in here at a higher level anyway. You know, with obviously better gear because we're higher level and paid so yeah oh it's short oh right okay I thought it was more like a you know fists of shocking truth or whatever what the hell am I cast what nano is it yeah I didn't think it was a short one buff line A they're short duration then are they I kind of wanted that they just naff off all your other skills I don't like them yeah I'll have to study up a little bit on those buffs I think okay I'm gonna end up with two down the hole here aren't I? come on then come get me yeah just not struggling with these the crunch will come as we turn this corner and start fighting those guys they are Damn, they like I say they hit easily twice as hard. Have to deal with you. Yeah, okay, that will do. Right now then, crunch time. Shadow mutant. The ones that hit so damn hard. Let's see. He's not hit me that hard. My ACs aren't all that. And I am at full lag against this guy. Oh yeah, there you go, 200 and, yeah, like double what the other guys were hitting for. And yeah, not that bad. Less, about the same as a heck, a level 80 heckler. But not quite as quick, maybe. I, don't know, I think the heckler was missing more. So we're going to kill three and then try and blitz through to the end to keep this, you know, as short and sweet as we can. And one more will do nicely. Yeah, they've obviously got a different thing. What was that? Polar? Ooh, Fists of the Polar Star. Ooh, I need to get that then. That's pretty awesome. Oh, God. Ripped you. Pick some of things. Yeah, okay, dude. Yeah. Hey. He's got bloody Slayer. Of course I'm going to join his team. What am I going to do? Out damage a Slayer? I don't think so. Oh, she's giving me the buff she's got, I guess. Awesome, I think. This is going to go rather quickly, then. Is the MA thinking, ah, oh, just run through? I think she is, isn't she? Oh, can they know it's me? Uh. Oh, well. <laughs> Yay, ding. Oh, yeah, 76. Okay, the, the speed we're going, I think we're going to be faffing with... Uh, I don't remember. I don't think I had a Slayer when I came in here on my Engineer, so he's doing real well. Are we just killing everything inside? I'm assuming the MA has got the Gamma Kick card clearance, and they've got it... They've equipped that. Because the, the mobs are not actually aggroing them from what I'm looking at. Uh, 
let's just get at least well I'm not what would the hell was I wanting to spend on uh, uh, I, I want to put in there which doesn't leave a lot for nano it was sent simp I needed and a lot more than that I'm gonna go with that for now Ooh. Got too much going on in here. Yeah, research. Let's take that out of there. Uh, is it public? Research, yeah. We'll put research uh, into combat. Yeah, it's hard to follow a conversation when you got that. When the game first launched, really far back in the early days, um, the that you had one chat window and everything went in it, pretty much. That was it. You, you didn't have much in the way of options. I'd say, have you, have you not got the clearance? Are you a noob? Are you a noob? You must be a noob. It's like, yeah, kind of. I'm a noob in here on this, this character. What are we on there? Oh, God, we're on bodyguards, but... Oh, let's go and do my trick. Come on. Just like run, 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 run. Get to here. Ah, oh, nearly. And then, yay. Being lazy here. Oh, Tim, Tim is up. I don't really need Tim. That Slayer could take Tim out, though, I think. Guess we're killing all the mobs. These guys hit pretty hard, didn't they, for their level? She's got security clearance, so it's not really a problem for her. They, they just ignore her. Yeah, they're doing the quest, I think. I would say so. I just want to get the daily out of the way. Being 100%. Oh, God. There you go. Now these, how much did he hit for there? 270, that is a lot for his level. That is more than the nascent hecklers were hitting for, but they were, yeah, level 80. So he hits harder than a heckler in Shadowlands. There's something up with that. He's easier, to, he's got more HP as well. And this is where your card clearance runs out, actually. And you get to here. then these bodyguards would attack you anyway. Gems, check for gems. No. That might count. <laughs> I don't think it does, though. He has the rabbit. It was like Donnie Darko. Oh, whatever it was. What was the, what was the bloody movie? Donnie Darko? I don't know. I watched it a few times and confused myself watching it. Now, do you want quality of these 70s? I don't think I can use yet. No, I'm going to have to go faff about with sorting out gems. Oh, God. Five of the bloody things as well. Oh, well, I'm going. Nice people. There you go. Right, so now... Uh, yeah, let's get out of the yarn. There we go. I suppose I could just buy gems. I'm not spending millions on them, though. This is the height of laziness. It really is. Have to admit that. 25 million for that. Some trash that drops in, in missions. Oh, good God. I hate this mission. I can't do any of it. I'm going... Oh, my God. What kind of jet? Where did it want me to find the bloody things from? I know they drop off different mobs, but... <sighs> it is what it is. Right, so I had to come back here, and I've now farmed these, but 
I found that as well. I thought somebody might find that useful. That I just don't need, and I need a slot of space. Let's just see. How much did it say? What? No. Does that not count? Golden nugget. I'm trying to... No, I guess that doesn't count then. Uh, all right then. One of these does though, doesn't it? Do Mekeng. I could do that at the city, maybe. What about that one? Golden thingy. Yeah, I don't want to leave here until I'm sure I've got five that if I can't cut, then, you know, somebody else can. <laughs> like, if I'd have gone off with those, I'd have been coming back again, wouldn't I? At least with these, it says you can cut this. You know, if it doesn't say it can be cut... You see, that enriched note nugget is not. That's for uh, nanocrystals and stuff. Blue pearl thing, can we... Yeah, we can't, but we need that. So that's one, two, three, four, five. Bye. Don't want to be here any longer than I have to be. Already done my daily. I want to get out of here and go to somewhere else. Right, okay, I can't cut these. I'm going to have to trade them over in a bag, yada, yada, to another tune and then go hand them in. Right, so I cut these with the engineer. So it's like slightly overpowered for this job. So Mr. Carlsberg is the chap you want. He's just near the desk here. I have perfectly cut stones for you. Let me see them one at a time. You awkward, awkward son of a what? Is this side? Oh, do where the hell's it gone? I perfectly cut stones for you. Do I have to put it in my inventory? Too far. He just... He just poo-pooed my stones. I'm in the inventory. He accepted... Is that lanish then? Oh god, don't make me go back there for one more. I did have one, but he deleted it. Oh, you son of a bitch! Oh, you utter, utter, utter son of a... Oh, my God! I don't believe this. I'm going to have to go back there a bloody again. So, rather than re-logging, I've been back. I've looted another little item there, spring crystal, but it won't let me do it, I'm, I need 325, so I've come to the organisation city, because if you don't know, if you have one of the, oh yeah, we constantly have silliness in this corridor, um, if you don't know, if you go to this machine over here on the west side, this teleport, takes you up here, if you click on this, it gives you a rather big buff. Uh, I don't even know if it shows up in your NCU. But you can see there. So now, I has a spring crystal. You can only use it every 10 minutes, but that, this is how I made the alien tank armor by coming up here and using the machine. That and a buff did it, so does not buff complete, which is actually getting quite high now. I should start thinking about a uh, six slot belt. I'm definitely within range of it. That's for sure. So yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Big old city. It's awesome. We've had it a very long time. Oh, shark. Yeah, you can actually aggro those. If you come in on an M for Mongo, you will get them. What have we got? Wedding cake. Frosty the snowman. Yeah, they, and that, a ceiling fan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what the score was there. One of the uh, things I tried to hand to him, he absolutely didn't want. Um, he just said, is this some kind of joke? And deleted the item. Th th this is, that's what gets me. Oh, have I got it back? Perfectly cut pearl of Rubicar. Now... Why did he not want that? Let's try him with it again. It's, now it's reappeared. I have perfectly cut stones for you. 
Let's just... I'm going to swap that in there. Was it because it was, I was giving it him from inside the bag? Let's give it him like this. Maybe that's the bug. It wouldn't let me trade it from there. So, in other words, I didn't have to go back, but it vanished. Yes, it bloody did. I just hope I don't have to do that anymore. Right, in an other level. Let's do a quick IP spend. Oh, God, the music. Can you save that and get out of here? Now, the downside of going to Shadowlands is we lose grid space freedom. Oh, yeah, freelancers. Freelancers is complete. I can go and hand it in. Go talk to Ralph very quickly. That's definitely a good plan. So, yeah, it must be since they did the uh, patch, which meant you could no longer trade directly from a bag. You know, which is bloody annoying. But it did, um, it did stop some exploits, so I'm not going to complain too much. It is annoying. It's annoying that you can't anymore. You've got to take it out of the bag first and then trade it. Um, so, yeah. Thank you, Ralph, for my second ding. Which I will put to good use. Yes, indeed. Body of defense. Save. And what did I need? Nano and casting. I got, I got the one I wanted. I'm going to stop there. I'm going to do that and a bit of that. And then the rest because we're going to Shadowlands, is going in there because we are going to lose so much run speed when we get there. There you go. The guys are gone. Can't get any more. Is the quest robot absent? Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah, it's every other week, if you didn't know. Every other week. Too far from Ralph. Well, you know deal with it Ralph okay so nascence nascence let's go not nascence Eli so oh god which exit do I want oh god I feel slow as on a slow thing uh, is it it is it's yeah it's the middle Okay, we're doing it. Trox and Sims is a very dark place. Visibly reduced to plenty of... Right, okay, we've got spec one. Is it worth even checking? I'll have a quick look in at the prop gear. Where I'm the MA guy. Yes, it's the um, giant fixtures from you first entered character creation. Oh, I've run past MA. What a cool looking dude. He's totally cool. Right, what have you got? Meditate, team healing, healing wooden skin, mastery, velocity. I've got this is a fire. What the hell is this one called? This is going to be a garden nano. Probably, yeah. Fists of the Polar Star. Yeah, probably Garden. Greater Healing Touch. What do I need for... Ooh, quite a bit more than I've got. Okay. Uh, I think Garden Nanos are going to be the ones. I, I had a look at the um, Nano Table for MA. My God, there ain't a lot there, is there? You know, like compared to... You know, well, as an extreme agent... All the stuff you can cast in FP versus what you can't versus your own nanos, etc. Right, uh, talk to the organ grinder. Gear to go, I will give you 10k, you greedy overcharging swines. Cut the deal, what do you want? 10k, okay. That loop. And let me in. Don't walk me back again. No, we did it. Oh, hello, big Shadowlands. I like this buff. I like that it's four hours long. And that it's 
fire damage. What I don't like is how tall the flames are. They're kind of nuts. Oh, scariness. Okay. Let's go and talk to Emo. Elmo. Emo. God. Can you tell me about this place? Why are you wearing a hat with a torch? I'll be able to look after myself. Come on, give me a mission. Okay, what do you want me to do? I'll give you 50,000 credits if you kill those. Okay. I think we can do that, you know. Pretty sure. If I can pull them okay, and they don't hand our arse to us instantly. <laughs> I have come down here at, like, level 50 and gone, this was a mistake. If you know what I mean, like... I really don't think I should be here kind of vibe, you know? I do like Elysium in in terms of design. I think it's a very beautiful kind of place. I think the same of Sheol as well, but... Um, Sheol is just vastly underused. Okay, what level are these guys? There's three plus two up there that will probably aggro. Blood Red, level 102. Okay. Let's try you guys one at a time. I'm going to stay up here. They're probably, I mean, 20 levels higher than the hex I was fighting, so I'm imagining could be a bit problematic. Hitting for 290, 372. Yeah, they're pretty tough. Can I evade them if I drop back a bit? Maybe. Maybe. Pretty confident one on one. Three or four of them. Not so much. Okay, I've got a. Koala. Or koala one. Okay, I'm gonna deal. Oh, you're green. You're just, you're just being annoying. Okay. Anything nice? Ins you got an insignia for me? What? Did someone get, like, really quite far to killing that and then failed? Let's try and get another one. Come to me. Take the damage. You know you want to. Yeah, they do hit fairly hard. They do indeed. Can I evade them though? I go all the way over there on the aggro bar. Maybe. Might be a possibility. Seriously? Go away. Yeah. So if I, if I drop the uh, aggro bar down, it's not nearly so taxing. I mean, I was trying that at full ag, and, you know, you are kind of asking for trouble there. Okay, one more to complete this little quest. Big chunks of XP from them, though. Come on, then. Yeah, these are utter, utter gold in places like Shadowlands. Yes, they are. Yeah, I got hit through. Still hit me. Yeah, I don't think it's missing, is it? Full death? No, I don't think it is. I'm not getting critted anyway, so I'm going to go back to full lag. I don't think it was going to miss anyway. Oh, let's use that thing. Yeah, mini heal. I mean, that's okay for now. Probably not so much later. God, nearly 60k XP a kill. Can I get you on your own? Are you bugged? Oh, let's go back. Let's go back. Be sensible. Go hand this back to that guy, and we'll call it a day for now. But I'm going to definitely do a bunch of the quests here in Nascence. They do take forever, though. Nascence. Stop calling it Nascence. It's a Elysium, you muppet. They are very similar looking in colour. You know, like lots of green, but... Yeah, the um, the Yuttos quests here give you a ton of XP. Yes, they do. They'll get you to level 100 from... Where are we? 89, yeah. Look at that massive chunk there. Yes, I killed three devourers. Not bad. Sure, why do you ask? No problem, where should I go to? Oh, there we go. 
the melting pot. Yes, indeed. And give him this device, which is chuffing miles away. In fact, it's quicker to go to the garden and come out of a separate exit than it is to try and run the entire way. Will I do the garden key quest for here? Maybe. Maybe I'll do it. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Sided mobs generally drop insignias faster than non-sided. Ooh, green. Green you is. I'm going to get a bunch of you then. Yep. You're going to die. Come on, give me an insignia. The one that I'm worried about are oh, the silver spiders on the hill on the way up. Mind you, we might be alright, you know. I think the MA can handle it. Yes, I do. Down you go. Yeah, I'll be taking a lot less damage once I can get this tank armor on, which I'm not that far off now. Ooh, yeah, pretty close. Pretty close. Just need a couple more bits and pieces. Come on. Give me an insignia. I'm really not joking about this, guys. I want an insignia. I know what you're thinking. Get Go team with someone and do a bit of an LE mission. I will. I'm going to get saved here first, though. Oh, I, I've been rooted. Not. Okay, that didn't last very long. Yay! See ya. I don't think they like me anymore. Am I snared? I've got the animation for snare, but I don't. Uh, I don't, don't seem to. 24 minutes left on Beamoth. Uh, these guys will follow. I was always mildly kind of disappointed. What level are they? Oh, still, yeah, they're very yellow, so they're going to attack for quite a long time. Um, full death. Always slightly disappointed that if you ran up here, the, these guys didn't help you out. I always thought, you know, come on. Help me out, dudes. But no, it wasn't to be. Okay, we're here. Let's save. Yeah, that was a lot of XP to lose had we lost it. Okay, can I have my character back now? Thank you. I really need to clean out my inventory, don't I? Right, nearest one there is Ripwell, which I have no idea where it is. Ripwell. So instead of running right across the map past hecklers and stuff, you can, it's much easier to just do that and get through the garden. In fact, I'd recommend that to anyone travelling around uh, Elysium or anywhere in Shadowlands. You, oh, God, for God's sake, use the gardens. Come on, let me through. Let me through. Yep, that's where we're going. And even if on the map it didn't look that far, it is. Trust me, it's miles. It doesn't look far, but it is. Yes, it is. Who am I talking to? Delivery, device delivery to one who wins over mines. And he hands him some device. And it's called some device. <laughs> 10 out of 10 originality. There he is. One who wins over mind. Elmo Fitz at Port 7 asked me to give you this. There you go. And ding, level 80. New perk. Carefully battle. Denied, you need level 100. Brawler, maybe. Acrobat, can't do. Enhanced DNA. I kind of want to uh, to get that tank armor on. So we're going for that. Although I should, there's probably something here I should be putting into now, like spiritual master. Something in there, maybe. Don't know. Can I get... Oh, oh, should I swap one of my... What have I got in? You know, like, swap one of these and put it into... Probably, yeah. I'll have a, I'll have a, I'll have a think about that. Bluetooth harvest. <laughs> Go around hacking everyone's phone. 
yeah, we'll we'll do it once. Once gives you a, a proper mission. And then the these other guys, yeah. You look a bit tired. Yes, I will help you. I can't remember. Yeah, so just say yes to all the missions and then go do them. That is basically what we're going to do here, as well as spend a tiny bit of IP. Yes, indeed. He likes the spendage. I want to get to 700-ish on there. And I need to look at nano skills more closely. All right, but I'm going to leave it there for this video. I will record myself carrying on with the rest of uh, Elysium. I quite like the quests here, although some of them do get annoying. <laughs> you know, when you're, you're kind of like all over the flipping map. Kind of a thing. So yeah. Okay folks. Bye for now.